We are in the midst of an unprecedented global climate crisis and an interrelated global biodiversity crisis. These crises are having enormous impacts on the human rights of people all over the world. And in my role as Special Rapporteur, I have witnessed this firsthand, Indigenous peoples from Fiji to Norway, whose lives and livelihoods are being disrupted by climate change and biodiversity loss. There is one clear path forward, which is to adopt a rights-based approach to all climate action and all biodiversity conservation actions. This has been proven scientifically to be the most efficient, effective, and equitable way forward. And so I urge all nations in the lead up to COP15 and COP26 to ensure that human rights are at the heart of climate action and biodiversity conservation. Thank you very much.